go. And Alabama will work from the 25-yard line. And he leads that great offensive line for the tie. First down. And the throw is complete. And it's Devontae Smith right off the bat. And he's got about eight yards on the opening snap. Najee Harris. Nice spin move. First down. Still going up to the 45-yard line. Matt Jones trying to move the center official out of the way and does. And they jumped offside. Landon Dickerson says it was the nose. Neil Farrell, if he's right, it's a first down. Offside with contact. Defense number 92. And two tight ends in play action. Jones rifles it down the middle to Mechie. And Mechie's got it all the way down to the 20 yard line. Neil Billingsley, number 19, another tight end in motion. Najee Harris inside the 10, the 5, the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. We've lost Brad and Gary up in the booth for right now as TJ Finley hands the ball off. I know our team is working feverishly to get them back. But Ed Ogeron once again went with Finley for the start, but he did say that they will be using Max Johnson throughout this evening. T.J. Finley opening up the first couple plays here in his series. The pass play, the tight end, Arik Gilbert. T.J. Finley once again connecting. Eric Gilbert. There you go, Brad. Hi, Jamie. Good I to have knew, you back. I knew you wanted my job. They always say it's crazy in Death Valley on a Saturday night. Well, there you go. And LSU. On the move with Finley again throwing complete. And it looks like it's going to be a first down to Boutte. Blitz coming. And a nice run by Davis Price. He's short of the first down by about a yard. So here they're trying to get it to the basically 14 yard line. And they didn't. Nothing. Wow. What a stop. Christian Harris was the first guy there. They decided to go the running back off tackle. Didn't work. Play fake. Matt Jones firing complete. Got it to Billingsley, and he's all the way out across the 40. First down of the pickup of 27 to the 42. Here's a toss sweep. Najee Harris with blockers in front. Broke one tackle. Now he turns on the speed, and he's all the way to the 31-yard line before he flies in to the and LSU gonna, bench. And it's going to be 15 more or half the distance to the goal, either way you want to look at Is it. Is Coach Robbie? That was a late hit by Jacoby Stevens, who's letting everybody know he's in the vicinity tonight, including Devontae Smith and Najee Harris. At the 15, a little toss. Devontae Smith with Mechie blocking down the sideline. He's got it down inside the five. How but as pretty as this play designed by Steve Sarkeesian. Alabama with their jumbo set in there now on second down and goal inside the one. Najee Harris. Big pile up at the goal line. No signal yet. After review, the runner stretched the ball across the goal line with possession, resulting in the touchdown. Takes the hand up. He's in trouble immediately. Trying to get away and can't. They'll bring him down at the 25. Daniel Wright, one of the first guys there. And a big time veteran at quarterback. Dave Smith just gets everybody out of the way. Yeah, this, the kick goes out think, of the bounds. I don't think this uh, made the 50 even. Uh, no, it didn't. So. Forrestal, the tight end in motion, sets in the backfield for Alabama. Najee Harris weaving his way through, close to another first down, about a yard shy. They've got a package, they believe it, and they've got a lot of weapons. This time, LSU equal to the task. Jacoby Stevens again. Billingsley in motion. The throw is out to Billingsley for an easy first down. And Derek Stingley has to bring him down, but he's going to move the chains again. Mac Jones perfect so far. 
this season or this game? <laughs> Just this game, but he's close to perfect on the season. He wants more right here. Got it. Going to go long. Got a wide open touchdown to Billingsley. Handled kick and now they'll have to return it. Did simply call fair catch Boutte or did his knee go down? Finley throws complete and it's going to be close to a first down to Kirkland. And you know, Christian is licking his chops in this game because he's a Baton Rouge native playing in his hometown. Harris a double clutch got the pass complete. Tough tackle there, uh, Boutte. Personal foul, rough in the passer, defense number eight. Seven yards away from I, him. I had a coach young in my NFL career there said when those guys are coming across like that, throw them an egg, not a rock, something easy to catch. <laughs> well, that time he threw another pretty good rock. Yep, he can throw a rock to the outside. Those are catchable. Davis Price with Finley in the LSU backfield. Finley to throw, rifles it down the middle. On his way is Keishon Boutte. Touchdown. Two tight end set for Alabama. On the give is Robinson. And Robinson goes out for what looks like a first down. Well, he only went 45 and 1 for North Dakota State as they won three championships when he was there. Mac Jones going deep. Devante Smith is gone. Touchdown, Alabama. How many times have we said that this year? A lot. Keep your head in the game. Finley. Scans a field, rivals it down the middle, and Sertan is all wrapped up with Jenkins incomplete, and Jenkins still down. I don't three. know that it was helmet to helmet, but it's a foul targeting defense yep. number three. John Emery. Off the left side, and a nice run by Emery. A blocker in front, John Emery. Going to take it to the house. Touchdown, LSU. Robinson and Harris both in the backfield. Now Robinson clears out. Jones looked at him, and now throws back the other way. What a catch by Najee Harris. And he's still going, and he got a first down. you got to be kidding me. Yeah, it was designed the whole way. First 10 pass attempts. For Mac Jones, including two more touchdowns. Plenty of time here. Deep for Devontae Smith in stride again. And goodbye again. Devontae Smith touchdown. Smith, Harris, and Jones. Sounds like a law firm or an old, old Western. John Emery, who had a touchdown the last time he touched it, just rumbles out to the 45-yard line. I'm curious, though, that he's not matching up against Smith on the inside. Aren't you sure it's cost him? He might be done matching up with him all night. Who knows? He's a throw, throw. And a good one to Torrey Carter. <laughs> Emery hit and dropped for a loss this time. Christian Harris thus far, but this is a big one. Third and 14. Pressure coming up the middle. The ball is out. Finley trying to get back on top of it and does, but it's going to be fourth down. Still got a big one right now in Devante. Two good running backs they had. Here's Jones from his own end zone. He's still perfect. And by the way, you can add three more touchdowns to those numbers we just showed you. That was coming into the game. Jones Back to the completion now to Devontae Smith. Smith in the open field, trying to outrun everybody. Stingley giving chase. He'll bring him down, but not before he's to the 25-yard line. Picked up by the easy throw by Mack to Devontae Smith. Yeah, the medium became a 49-yard gain, and here is Brian Robinson. Cuts up, and he's got the first down at the 15-yard line. Billingsley in there basically is a wide receiver again to the bottom of your screen. Jones. Scans the field, throws incomplete intended for Harris, and it'll be fourth down. But well, this guy hasn't missed yet this year. Well, record eight for eight on the year. He'll try 30 yard attempts to add to the Alabama lead, and he's got it. 
Third and five. Whoa. Look out, TJ. Throws complete. Oh, he's out of bounds. Intended for Gilbert. Najee Harris got through the first wave and picked up almost nine. This is an ongoing college football record of 35 points or more in now 22 straight games and were, by the way, not till halftime yet. Najee Harris into the secondary, down to the 35 yard line. Mac Jones, a little bit of pressure this time, rifles it across the middle to Mechie, and a first down at the 20. Jones goes to the end zone. Oh, what a catch! Come Devontae on. Smith, touchdown Alabama! Holy cow! Just put it on the highlight reel and add to it, and then send the Bolitnikoff Award to him right now, will you? Somebody just send the Bolitnikoff Award. When that award ball to was thrown, I thought it was out of the end zone. I did too. Third down, a long yard, and in and out of the hands of the intended receiver. And that's where they'll go to the locker room with a 45 to 14 lead. 470 yards in a half of football against LSU. I asked coach if he was okay. He said Stingley is fine. But keep in mind, Stingley and Devontae Smith grew up together nearby. Remember they had four first round picks off their offense in the NFL draft last year. Here's a toss sweep to Najee Harris who already has 100 plus yard night and he's got nine more they're in a big hole now and now they face the alabama offense again with their opening march of the third quarter and Najee harris has got a first down <laughs> all heads turn at the exact same time they even do that efficiently jones gonna go deep double coverage out there and almost caught anyway by mechie had his hands on it but couldn't hold it that uh, that he brought to the table finley Pull that one down, and now he's going down. Will Anderson will drop him, along with Byron Young. After Von Rosenberg's punt, Slay Bold and Waits on the other end for it. Clears everybody out of the way. Really haven't had to return anything or really fair catch much because it hasn't been number 38's best punting night. Alabama, first down from the 41. Mac Jones getting a little heat down the middle, competes it to Devontae Smith. And another first down and a pickup of 12 or 13 more. Najee comes all the way across the field in motion. Jones down the middle, complete to Forrestall. No, nope. it's Bolden. Bolden lost the ball. And Stingley picks it up on one hop. Slade Bolden had it, had it stripped out. I'm going to say it was the way. I just paused it to say like, like that time he just kind of flicked it to him, didn't fire it at him. And quarterback sneak will get LSU the first down. You want to keep your starters, especially your important players, as fresh as possible. Finley loads and goes on a crossing route again. And there is Gilbert. Did he have it taken away from him? Looked like he had it and then had it ripped out by the Alabama defender. And I think that's Christopher Allen who was covering him. At the 34, Jones, quick throw, got it complete. And that's Mechie. And Devontae with 231. And that's Brian Robinson. Broke one tackle, cuts it upfield. And Alligate, a first down. Alligate had a shot at him. Now what? Devontae Smith in motion, a third down and six. Jones is going to throw it out in the flat. And it's Robinson. Had the first down, I think, at the 11 yard line. Najee Harris blasts off the left side and cruises to an Alabama touchdown, his third of the night. From that secondary, only Sertan was back this year, and they've now filled admirably. Much better now, watch them than at the beginning of the year. And here's a first down throw to Trey Palmer. As Gary said, Sertan was the only guy coming back that had a lot of experience and was a starter. That's first down. Tom Athens, of course, uh, Mark Rick is his uncle, was recruited by Miami. Your uncle's got to recruit you. <laughs> Woo! Big hit. 
put on. Pretty interesting to listen to it all take place. Little did we know that Jamie was doing a better job of it than I was. <laughs> Winding down to third quarter, Johnson uh, hit his guy in the hands, but Jenkins couldn't hold it. And this is going to be right about at 52. He had a 45-yarder and four extra points in last year's game from 52 yards out. Got it. Nice. Cade York. Got some good players up there, including Najee Harris, the good hands team. And Devontae Smith at the bottom down here. Well, there it is. And a one-hopper. Devontae Smith had it pop out of his hands. But I think Alabama got it anyway, Sir Tanner Harris. That had some juice on it, didn't it? Still the start. So we're going to finish off this drive, I think, before we see Bryce Young and some of the backups. And they keep it on the ground. Brian Robinson, he's got the first down and more as he continues to run hard. And, and Gary said one play, and that's about it because now yep. Bryce Young is in at quarterback. And Brian Robinson still running it in for Najee Harris and takes it almost down to the 20 yard line. I think they're going into that game, win or lose, they're in the playoffs. Low snap, handled well though, and Robinson blasts his way for a first down. Inside the 10, around the 7. That was Dickerson again. He, he's nuts. <laughs> he, he's crazy. Yep. Play action, Young trying to throw. They'll dump him, and it's Ali Gay with a sack. Perfect on the season. As both a field goal kicker and in his extra points. This will be from 34 yards out. And he's got it up and good. To make it 55 to 17. Happy birthday, Happy Sam. Birthday. Well, I blame my mother and a little bit my husband, but I can't blame him because it's was his birthday, too. Jamie's birthday Thursday and her husband Sam's yesterday. And meanwhile, uh, Brooke looked a lot happier in that family photo <laughs> than she did with Santa. <laughs> the Max Johnson running the show here. Fires on a crossing route. Got it to Carter. And Tory Carter with a first down. Well, Florida wrapped up the East earlier, if you missed it. And their win over Tennessee in our first game of a doubleheader on CBS. Alabama is 938 away from wrapping up the West. And the two best teams in the SEC should be a lot of fun. Throw it away, get second 10. Three receivers to his left, and the left hander's in trouble. And ooh, it's not a good landing as he goes down. And hopefully he's okay. Six man front, and they bring the free safety. In a hurry. And a crossing route is complete. And Boutte trying to spin his way for a first down, gets thrown out by Malachi Moore about a yard shy. Maybe a step too deep before he blitzed. Did Johnson pick up the first down on the sneak? He can. His forward progress got it for him anyway. Johnson, quick throw, catch, and close to another first down as Boutte might have it. They're all six foot three, six foot four, 240, 50 pounds, and they can run. Johnson bobbled a snap. Got to try to get rid of it. Somehow left handed it out of there as Malachi Moore was draped all over him. Bradford flushes out of the backfield as a wide out. Man, quarterback draw. Or go to the tight end. It almost one handed it. Sertan was there, number two on number two. I think when the Alabama players are interviewed after the game, they're going to talk a lot about last year's game, seeing, and, and, and deservedly so. LSU, you know, I mean, they deserve that win to celebrate on their turf, but I think that's stuck in their craw. Yeah. Bryce Young on the give, and here's a big hole, and all the way into the secondary goes. Jace McClellan again. And normally you'd say Ohio State, but do they have enough games is the question mark. Five is not as, it's half as many as Notre Dame's got right now. It's going to be the huge talking point at the end of the season, especially the Michigan game is in doubt. They've done a good job to try to get everybody to play all 10 games. Here's a first down run by Roydell Williams. Gonna have a couple more, but <laughs> well, there's gonna have more than more than a couple more first round draft choices off this team too. I, 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 so it's a trip to the SEC championship game against Florida, coming up in uh, what is that? Two weeks? Three weeks?
Two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah, we got Army Navy, and then we got the SEC championship game. Bryce Young takes a knee. Alabama will go to nine and zero. Oh. And they've won 97 straight games against unranked opponents. And if you're worried about Najee Harris with that towel, he did have a heating pad on the inside. I told you his hands were cold. He's from California. <laughs> That's I mean, right. It's, it's probably 40 degrees out here right now. So the payback from a year ago is complete for the Crimson Tide. And LSU drops to 3-5. and five. The Tide goes to 9-0. and oh, And they go to Atlanta against Florida.